So it's been a while since we've done story time, so I figured I'd do that today. I had difficulty thinking up of one, but uh, Isaiah helped me remember the time when a bug flew right on my glasses. Hello everybody, I hope you guys are doing good today. Now I think this story is going to be relatively short because the, the event was somewhat short. So I'm going to walk you through just what was going through my mind during each and every part. Now Isaiah was with me during this time. That's why he reminded me of when this happened. I remember it was, it, it was during school, we were in high school, and it was the end of the day. So we're exiting the building, heading toward the buses that, are, that will drive us home. We're just talking, you know, about anything, you know, it's, it's, it's a very, very ordinary time. Then all of a sudden, something, I, I see something land smack, I believe it was this eye, something landed smack right in the middle of my glasses. You have to understand. For those of you who do not wear glasses, even if you do wear glasses and this just doesn't happen to you, I will tell you how it is for me. Anything that gets too close to just my face, my eyes, and my glasses, I become very sensitive to. It's like if anything that I'm not expecting comes at me, like, but I'm mostly talking about my glasses here, I, I, I get, I guess I freak out a little bit. Not like freak out, freak out, but it's like kind of like, these my, my glasses are very very important to me like these these are my vision so if they ever get like I, I clean them like constantly if they get like scratched or buffed or like a fingerprint or anything i really really don't like that because that's messing with my vision not only that but like i said my glasses are like right by my eyes so if something is coming at me on my glasses there's actually a chance it can get into my eyes for those of you who don't wear glasses Stuff can still get in your eyes even if you wear it like it's weird like rain snow sand or just just anything It could just somehow go past and go into your eye. So while I am talking to Isaiah The moment it's weird because it's like I think I kind of saw it in my peripheral vision It just looked like this brown thing and almost like a leaf and then it's just like click like right there and I freaked out I started thrashing around like I, I didn't hit anybody like I believe we were still like like enough space I think people were kind of like looking at me though because I was I was I was doing like this I was like what is this like what is this in my eye like and like Isaiah he's looking at me he's trying to like calm me down but I, I see him laughing because he wasn't laughing at me I think it's just because we're right in the middle like it's like you're just having an ordinary conversation with your friend and then all of a sudden just like, <laughs> it's like it, was, it was like confused and still just like funny so he's trying to get me to calm down and I'm not calming down but he was just like take off your glasses take off your glasses I was like okay okay so then I take off my glasses because it's like I, at first I like I said I thought it was a leaf like it's not really the first time something has flown into my my glasses because sometimes if it is a leaf or just like some type of small little thing it'll like hit me but then it'll go right away what was freaking me out was that it stuck like it stuck there and I it wasn't moving and that was freaking me out so I take off my glasses we look at it and it's a bug it's like this weird I don't remember how it looked like but it was just some weird brown bug and we were shaking my glasses like not enough to break them but you know sufficient force for the bug to leave and it wouldn't fly off it was weird it was like it stuck itself to my glasses I mean it's like it didn't actually attach itself but you know where it's like a bug is just not moving no matter what so then it's like I think we had to get like a, I think Isaiah like got a leaf and he we, we actually had to like like pluck it off of my glasses and I, it's like he was dying laughing I'm like still like frazzled but that was just, that was such a bizarre experience. What he found so funny about it, I think, was just the sheer coincidence that out of this big open space, all of these people, and the tiny little bug, and just everything that this one little bug ends up flying directly onto my glasses and not 
moving. Like it, it was just the the strangeness of the whole thing. But yeah, there you go. That's the story of how a bug flew onto my glasses. Like I really, really don't like it when things touch my glasses. Like I don't even like touching my glasses um, myself. At least you know the lenses because you know then I start getting fingerprints. But um, I mean, I, I'll admit after the fact, I thought it was kind of funny. But mostly, like I said, just due to the. To, like I said, just to the bizarreness of the event and the coincidence. And like I said, I think I kind of accidentally made a fool of myself. Because as I'm freaking out, like I said, I think there are other people around me. Or like other people coming out the building looking at me. But, ooh, oh my goodness, I don't know. But thank you all so much for tuning in. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you know when my videos are going up. And be sure to show your support by donating in the links below. So thank you so much for tuning in. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just remembering it. Thank you so much for tuning in, and I'll talk to you in the next one. See ya.